Lifting up Jesus, opening his word from Australia, Denmark, Israel, Japan, New Zealand, Northern Ireland, Republic of Ireland, Singapore, South Africa, United Kingdom, Thailand, the Philippines, the United States, and throughout the world. You're watching Morial TV. As we see in the book of Job, Satan has access both to earth and heaven at the present time. We see the same thing in the book of Zechariah, and we again see it in the book of Revelation. Satan will ultimately be cast down from heaven, and his only abode will be to be, as it were, incarnated inside of the resurrected body of the Antichrist, the man of lawlessness. This has not happened yet. It is going to happen. One of the reasons we read there will be a new heaven and a new earth, one of the reasons, I'm not saying necessarily the only reason, but one of the reasons there will have to be a new heaven is that in the new heaven, Satan will not have any access to it. He will never, as it were, to use an anthropomorphism, set foot in it. He will not be able to accuse the saints anymore. He won't be there. There'll be a new heaven in which he will never have been and never will be. But at the present time, he still is the accuser of the brethren, accusing us before the throne, the same as he accused uh, Yeshua, not Jesus Yeshua, but the high priest Yeshua and Zerubbabel in the book of Zechariah, and as he accused Job in the book of Job, well, he's accusing us before the throne. This will come to an end. There will be a battle between him and the archangel, Michael, he was like unto God. Satan will be thrown down. His only abode at that point will be, as it were, to be incarnated in the resurrected corpse of the Antichrist. Thank you so much for your question. God bless. Thank you.